Hello everybody and welcome to this first impression video of a garden story. Little voice crack, but it's fine. Garden story. Embark on a wholesome adventure to save the grove. Forage resources, combat the invasive rot and restore the community. Relax and enjoy the fruits of your labor in this charming action RPG. Staring a grape. Okay. So it is a chill game set in a cozy village. We're growing with the town and it is apparently a satisfying journey of rebuilding and collecting. We're playing at our own pace and we can also make it a little bit less stressful by, uh, I guess, turning off combat. We'll see how that works. Features. Explore a lush living world. Immerse yourself in the grove's vibrant organic ecosystem with four distinct and adorable regions to enjoy. Foster community. Take on requests, complete favors and work as a role model to provide inhabitants with the confidence to support one another. Don't be afraid to ask for help. We're rebuilding together. Combat rot. Solve puzzles and fend off rot as you delve into particularly infested locations of the grove. Take caution. Especially formidable rot have taken res residence in the depths of these areas. Experiment with equipment, utilize a variety of items to help gather resources, grow gardens, stave off rot, solve puzzles and indulge in the occasional musical interlude. Cultivate your home, care for garden plots, gather resources, curate libraries, upgrade your tools and rebuild structures. Okay, so this is more of a short game apparently, so we'll see how long that takes us and let's dive right in, shall we? And also, real quick, oh my table, <laughs> just a quick shameless plug, I'm in a band called Foreign Skies as some of you might know and we are about to release our first single and I'm very excited. So if you want to follow along and be one of the first ones to listen to that song, make sure to check out the handles in the description box. So excited! Okay, let's start this game, shall we? Okay, first off, we're gonna make this true. Parish prevention prevents Concord from losing all HP, inflicts an injury debuff that may be removed with healing. Uh, I guess that's one of the things that helps us have less... Ooh, less combat or something, or a less hard time. <laughs> okay, and these are the controls. I think this will be a little bit tricky. Initially, I could also just play with a controller, but um, I don't want to right now. <laughs> okay, I guess we'll see how that goes. So let's uh, start a new game. Hell yes. In our beginning, there was The Grove. Timeless, supernatural and sentient, this is the foundation of our home and the source of our existence. A tree so large and overflowing with mana, it spilled over, populating its foundation with our peoples. Malvolent, oozing rot has seeped in, seeking to separate us from our greatest protector. Many heeded the rot's challenge, rallying the grove to a time of bravery and action. Each guardian exploring a new horizon of life's many possibilities. More stepped up for the community. For the first time, we truly grew. To most, it was their first time fighting. The meek forged their spirits in combat. When the island grew weaker, their desperation and hubris spelled demise for all but two. The heroes of our world forever lost, chasing the final horizon beyond our island. The Grove, ever mourning, wants for a new guardian to lead them. In a new age of turmoil, fate focuses on Concord, the youngest of Spring Hamlet. A quiet gardener of few words and fewer aspirations. Is that us? <laughs> well, it's a grape. I think it's us. <laughs> Stretch your legs. Move around for a bit before work. Okay, let's go. By the way, it is so warm. My mustache is sweating. <laughs> it's bad, but never mind. I'll be okay. <laughs> okay, we moved. Check the kindergarten vine and interact. I guess that's here. We're interacting. The leaves are a little wilted. They could use some dew. Uh, okay, let's obtain our working tools. The vine has seen better days. Search the tool shed. Okay. Tutorial time. Inside lies Concord's rucksack and an empty jar. Take them? Yes. The tool shed is now empty. Thank you. Um... 
Okay, make the jar your active item. Okay, here we go. Um, equip jar, I guess. Interact with the well. I thought it said the wall. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god. Um... Jar is empty. Ah, because I tried to walk with WASD. Yikes. Tap do. I am. Ah, hold E. I am. I wonder if it's having difficulties with with the buttons I chose because I do not know. Let's try and reset the keybinds. Okay, let's do that. Ah, okay, yeah, now it works. Okay. <laughs> and use your dew drop near the vine. And let's go. The issue is I have a European keyboard or a German keyboard. And so Z is where the Y is. No, hold on. <laughs> it's telling me to use Z and I think that was because Technically, it's in proximity to the other buttons. In other games, it automatically switches. We're using our Dutra, do drops, and we did something. Enchanted by do, it doesn't look nearly as wilted as before, yet it still refuses to grow more do. Concord, you busy right now? Hey, Plum, come say hi to good old Plum. Plum has returned to the kindergarten. Uh, how do we get to Plum? Evening, Concord. Looks like you've been working hard. You toil so much for a vine that refuses to grow. Oh geez, have you been locked up there this whole time? Let me get this gate open for you. I'm really sorry about that. Nothing here works like it used to. Not since we lost Alio. My work is good and honest, yet even with all the effort, it seems like the grove is still slipping away. At least I can come back here to you for a breath of fresh air. You never ask me for anything yet sorry for getting here so late got caught up with some trouble in bell row i'm gonna make it up to you though where is there a heart what kind of trouble <laughs> um i've got a gift for you granny smith just completed it and it's ready for pickup in the hamlet i know you don't usually travel outside the kindergarten so take this map i don't want you to get lost hee <laughs> hee spring hamlet is just southeast right through the river ways i labeled them on the map already but you have the pleasure of charting the rest of the grove. Grove, um, grove map get. Yes, grove map get. Let's go. Map. This is the map. This is a bit overwhelming right now. <laughs> but I'm. Oh, I guess it's just the beginning. It's fine. It's fine. We're gonna be fine. This looks a little bit like um, a plant that would attack you in Core Keeper. Head to the wood forge in the hamlet. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Where's the hamlet? I guess we'll see. The map's not really helping right now, but I guess we'll fill it with information. Head to the wood forge in the hamlet. Okay, I need the gift. Where's my gift? Is this my gift? I doubt it. I did something. But my jar is empty. Okay, my map extended. This is the river way, so it's not the hamlet. Um, can't go back. <laughs> well, I guess we'll... Ooh, Rana. Whoa, Concord, getting bored of watering plants all day. Never too late to join the rest of us in the hamlet. Okay, so I guess this is the hamlet. If you ask me, we have enough greenlings already. I think we could use more frogs in the grove. Do us all some good. Good to see you stepping out of the kindergarten, finally in your rebellious face. Don't worry, I won't tell Guardian Plum you're sneaking out. Might want to be careful, I saw him around. Anyway, it's getting late and the rot's starting to pop up. You know how they get once the sun sets. Don't want to see Tiny Gardener fighting rot with their bare hands. That would be pathetic, haha. <laughs> okay, but can I try to find my gift? Where is my gift? Where do I need to go? And now it's night time. Spring Hamlet added to your map, so it must be here it is. Ah, Plum. We found Plum. Over here, Concord. I hope you like it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What is it? Why does this thing look familiar? Does this look like some turnip boy monster or something? Anyways, the rot is staring in new ways. I can hear rumbling in the pits of the library, Tumshi. There it goes again. Will I ever feel safe again? Head to the wood forge. 
I shouldn't wander too far without plum. Ah, if I could read, I would know that I have to go in here, I guess, at night. Granny Smith, sweet little Concord, come to bless my little shop. Plum told me you'd be visiting here, paid me a pretty price to, price to make this for you. Everyone's talking a lot about the Grove's condition, and we're all worried about you. Rana's been talking about getting you out of the kindergarten. You're all alone there. These rot are spelling dangerous times, eh? And a tender grape could use the protection. Still, it's a lot of guardian plum to be equipping the youngest of... What? Still, it's a lot for guardian plum to be equipping the youngest of the hamlet with a weapon. There have been a lot of mix-ups. Villagers have been moved around everywhere to accommodate the encroaching rot. Even now, it's hard for any of us to catch a break. Too much rot everywhere, right? If the vine refuses to produce more greenlings, you may very well remain the youngest of us. You should come by more often. We barely see you, Concord. Chumshi could use a comforting friend. Plus, a dedicated gardener like you will have need for a spade later, just like Plum. Sounds exciting. And if you ever get tired of gardening, we have no shortage of other work to be done. Pick, get, gather items from the environment by whacking them. Okay, head back to the kindergarten. But it's night time. Tomshi, do you want to come? The rod is stirring a new ways in the library. Ah, okay. Bye. Plum. I'm sure Granny Smith had some choice of words. They made me pay extra to make it for you. Even a harvesting tool like the pick carries the connotation of battle now. I think it worries some to know that a secluded grape like you is readying for combat. Let's head back to the kindergarten before it gets too late. But try your new pick, just in case we run into something. Foreshadowing much? How did I change that again? Here's my pick. Equip tool. Is it equipped? How do I use it? Use main tool with Z. Doesn't seem to be my main tool right now. Ah, so now it is equipped, I guess. Uh, well, is it? Yes, it is. Okay, head back home in the middle of the night. Sure, it'll be fine. There's something, look, there's, look, look, look at it. <laughs> All right, Concord, you have your pick, but I want you to use it now. It may be good for gathering, but I want you to be able to defend yourself. Please, Concord, squash these rot. I'll keep you from getting too hurt. Just show me what you got, don't worry. Okay, thank you, squash the rot. Mm, uh, okay, I have to charge. How do I pick these up? Um, pick up with the... Oh, rot came back. Okay, I wanna leave. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. All right. Then I'll fight some more. Bam. Okay. Nasty things, aren't they? Under moonlight, they grow more resistance to our force. Greenlings may be born from the sun, but Raj prefer to be cover of night. Are you okay, Concord? That was fun. I'm fine. That was horrible. Guess I'm fine. You did really well. I'm proud of you. They say the pig was the first tool Hamlet villagers used to fight. Seems fitting for you, gardener. Thank you. It's a good idea to always be using do. It's for much more than just tending the kindergarten vine. Just drop, just one drop is all you need to make at least some of your wounds disappear. Okay. Plum is giving out weapons. I want one too. Well, yeah, that's right, Rana. You already have a pick. Get lost. Get lost. Give me that twig. Thank you. Hi, Plum. So, you know, I think you're doing great, Concord. I know you're still new to the grove and the villagers may baby you a bit much. You're babying me too. But I know they all look up to you in their own special way. Your new pick should mostly be used for gathering, but there will be times of danger. The rot may not always carry ill intent, but the damage they do is real. Since Cain picked me as a guardian, resisting them is, a, is all I've really known. With what little you know of the guardians, how do you feel about them? I have no idea. <laughs> uh, that's okay. Sorry, perhaps I asked too much of a greenling so fresh. You've barely ventured outside the kindergarten, much less the hamlet. If only you had a glimpse of what the entire grove had to offer. I've talked to Elderberry. We've decided to move you out of the kindergarten, okay? Well, thank you, Plum, for making those decisions for me. You may have some concerns, but I think you need to be around others. Your role here may have been sacred, sacred, <laughs> but the kindergarten vine is no longer producing greenlings. We're no longer needed here. That much I'm sure you've known for a while now. Tomorrow, pick up your things and meet me in the band. It's high time you live as the rest of the Hamlet does and I'm sure you'll come to enjoy it. Okay, go to bed. Okay, that's my bed. Let's rest. We're sleeping. Say goodbye to the kindergarten? Oh my God, why is this so sad? And I don't know where the band is actually. 
River Way, Spring Hamlet. Hmm, I'm guessing it's just where I came from. Bye, Kindergarten. See you later. Toodaloo. Head southwest. Okay. Is that southwest or is... I mean, it's more west than southwest. Oh, okay. I guess that's correct. Explore your new home. That's my new home. Ooh. You're a grumpy strawberry. Silly. Ah, good day, eh, Greenling? Don't squander it. Sorry if you want to enter, but this corner belongs to the Autumn Town Runaways. Don't worry, we're getting just... Uh, getting by just fine without you, bugger. So lot's real thankful to you Hamlet people for giving us a new place to live. But it ain't your na but it ain't our nature to depend on charity from softies like yourself. Okay. Don't take it the wrong way. I'm s I just can't do the accent. I don't even know what it's trying to do. I'm guessing something southern. Don't take it the wrong way. We just prefer to rely on the skills we've brought from Autumn Town. Okay. Here, Concord. Thank you for coming. I know it's a big change of pace, but we've tried our hardest to make this a new home for you. Thank you. Plum, it's a nice upgrade from that shack in the kindergarten at least, and a place like the Bend always has a nice flow of dew. Plum and I have a few more things to talk about. Rana, why don't you show them inside while we talk? You're with me. Take your time. We have a lot to talk about. Okay. Let's see. Rana's winking at me. Meet you inside. I'm just at a kindergarten, okay? <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Don't get too excited. This place was a total dump before we got it all set up. But I'm sure it's still way fancier than that shack in the kindergarten. Thank you. It's not a home without a pillow leaf to sleep on, of course. When you're done for the day, you can come here to rest your tired eyes. Or, you know, do what I do and just sit and think about cool things all day. Fuji repaired this old well here for you to use. You're probably used to using one to keep the vine fresh, but you'll be using it on yourself after you get hurt. So make sure you have plenty on hand. Okay. Um, if you collect any new cloves, you can change them out here for when you want to look your best. We've got a box here for our village storage. You can deposit our, your harvest into any of these boxes to save them for our town. Shipping box. There we go. Gotta keep your backpack nice and free for more resources. That's pretty much everything we were able to haul here. Take a look around, but don't get too comfy just yet. Let's go round up with those geezers before you doze off. I'm sure Elderberry had a few more words. They always have a few more words. <laughs> Okay, bye. Let's talk to Elderberry. It's already evening. Oh my god, the days are passing rather quickly. Feeling better about moving Concord? A few days more and I know this place will feel like home for you. When we first made this place, it was just for storage. Now our favorite sprout is living here. Is that me? I doubt it. I'd really like for you to be a more active part of the hamlet. Soon they'll need you for the coming days. I'm having Rana take you around tomorrow. I think a nice introduction to what daily life is like will be good for you. But for now, rest up in your new home. You look just a tad bit wilted and I want you ready for the next day and combat, I guess. And be careful for rot that may gather here. They've been catching villagers off guard at night. Love that. Head to sleep. Okay, I'll do that. Game saves. Going to sleep moves Concord to the next day and saves the game. Um, let's do this. Uh, okay, is this not what I wanted? I guess resting isn't the same as saving, or is it? How do I go to sleep? Or is rest correct? I guess it's correct today. Uh, blue sun, yellow sun, red sun, and dark blue sun. <laughs> Three requests. I guess we'll get to the bottom of that at some point. <laughs> All right, everybody. And I think that's it for this episode. Just to get a quick glimpse and to see what's lying ahead of us in the coming few episodes. Just a few before we're heading into the next game. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe to not miss out on the next episodes. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.